Hey everyone, I'm excited to share this project with you. I've had a lot of fun developing it. It's my HQ answerer. As many of you know, HQ is the new big hit trivia game that gives you less than 10 seconds to answer a multiple choice question. Answer 12 out of 12 questions, you win money. Sounds easy, right? Well, I thought so too until I consistently lost for over a month. That is when I decided to create my HQ answer. Uh, now just note, it is obviously against the HQ terms to use something like this during a live game, but it's a lot of fun to use afterwards. Now I just downloaded a random video recording of someone playing this game on YouTube a few days ago, and now I'm going to show you how my HQ answerer works on this recording. First I have an automator script set up so that when the question appears I can screenshot it and it will automatically be sent to my URL. That is what this upload3.sh does. Then it gets sent to the script, um, which does three different checks. It Googles the question, and then just looks for the most popular answer. Uh, it also Googles the question with each answer appended to it, and checks for the most popular answer. And it also counts the total results of each query. Then it uses all three of those, which are set up to run on parallel threads to calculate the, the overall answer, in less than 10 seconds. It's pretty cool, right? So let's see it in action. Remember, this isn't me playing, this is just a video I got off of YouTube. Let's get down to the nitty gritty and get this snow on the road. Cumero, numero, uno. Which of these is a popular pizza topping? Pepperoni, peanut butter, or passion fruit? Popular pizza topping. Passion from miles away. Passive with the things you say. Passion fruit. I'm in the minority there. Pepperoni is the popular pizza topping. Oh my goodness. So that was an easy question. Um, I'll run through the game now, and hopefully I can get all 12 out of 12 on this attempt. I've been doing it on a few games so far, and it's gotten 12 out of 12, uh, and I think I'll be able to do the same here. Slicing and dicing, which of these is not one of the Great Lakes? Lake Superior, Ricky Lake, or Lake Michigan? I am uh, married to the sea, but uh, I'm seeing two of the Great Lakes on the side. I'm not going to tell you which ones, but it's eerie how superior they are. Poetic forms is traditionally five lines long. Limerick, sonnet, or haiku. Limerick, sonnet, or haiku. High C. Haiku, sonnets are 14. If you guessed limerick, you got this in the bucket, baby. Cast and Lil John are rap acts from which city? New York, Chicago, or Atlanta? Oh my goodness, we had some brutality. Back to you. Shout out to Cater. Shout out Buckhead. R.I.P. Freak Nick. 157,019. Designer is credited with creating the little black dress. Christian Dior, Gianni Versace, or Coco Chanel. That little black dress that every lady has in her closet. In 1920. No, started it all with a little black. These was discovered first. The element uranium, the planet Neptune, or the planet Pluto. Not the Disney character, Pluto. Neptune, Pluto, planets, uranium, the element. Now, Neptune wasn't discovered until... Eight years later, by Martin Heinrich... Kla in what state? Illinois, New Jersey, or Michigan? Is it bringing in the Illinois? Bringing in... New Jersey, home of Rutgers. Rutgers won six to four and third. Supreme Court cases deals with the Sixth Amendment. Matt versus Ohio, Gideon versus Wainwright, or Lawrence v. Texas. Matt the Ohio. The Sixth Amendment, 
That's right. The Sixth Amendment is Gideon versus Wainwright and Sixth. Robert Downey Jr., Steve Martin, or Billy Crystal. Not an official SNL cast. Never made it a fish. Donalds once owned what baseball team? The Houston Astros, the San Diego Padres, or the Cincinnati Reds? The Red Legs, the Red Stockings. Just the Reds. The Strohs were... San Diego Padres, the Pods, and we have 965 Friar Faithfuls here at Q10. The rest of you saying... F Band launched in 1979 with a speech by what politician? Dan Quayle, Al Gore, or George H.W. Bush? 900. Al Gore, Mr. Here it is. Walker, Texas Ranger, was co created by the director of which Oscar winning film? Crash, Million Dollar Baby, or Driving Miss Daisy? Walker. Texas Ranger, not Balker, Texas Rangers pitch. Following year, which was Crash into Me, and we got 78 winners, baby! So 12 for 12, uh, that was pretty cool. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, if you want me to run it on another game or something, also let me know. And yeah, thanks for watching.